gone a long way. Made a long trek to get here uh, to the Baron Stadium. Had a great... First to his left. Back. Here comes some pressure. They're going to hand on Derek, but he scrambles out. Gets the ball downfield, and it's caught! Straight to tackle! He's going to get to the end zone! The Green Bay Vikings are on the board! He's got Pitts and Roland on the right side. He's looking left. He's going to throw to Goble into the end zone. Touchdown, Vikings! Ball was knocked loose, but they're giving the touchdown to Taylor Goble. Perez in the backfield with him again. Takes a snap. Throws right side. Uh, fighting for the end zone. Did he get in? That ball was completed to Davion Hurst. Touchdown, Vikings! Davion Hurst gets over the ball from the four-yard line. Takes the snap, looks left, looks right, fires right side, touchdown to Brady Rowland! <laughs> I can't my ballot back in the boy. Fulton takes the snap, he's going to throw. Pressure coming, Fulton's going deep, deep for Brady Rowland! They connect this time, touchdown! Brady Rowland! Wide receiver right, wide receiver left, Perez in the backfield. Fulton takes it, he's going to keep it and try to go up the top. He tried to push his way through the middle, touchdown! Craig's got Jordan underneath. He's going to try to option right side. Gets it out to Iquan D. D's got a lot of white jerseys around him, and he's blocked down. Loss of three. Well, now they, the Vikings said the Vikings have the ball. The Vikings stripped the ball. They've got the ball at the 33 yard line. The great new crowd is going crazy. The team is going nuts. Uh, you know, words can't really describe it right now. Um, it's just, it's pretty unique when, when you reach your goal. Uh, I've never done this before, and, you know, on any sports team, never, you never finished on top. Uh, so this is due to me, as I'm sure it is to a lot of guys on the team as well. But it's just, you know, it, it's nice to finally have a hard work in the offseason pay off. Um, but you know what, we're going to be ready to come back next year. It feels surreal to me. I still can't get the feeling that we are national champions. It's a great feeling, man. Hopefully we can celebrate more in the near future. Uh, winning a national championship, not many people get to do that. And our coaching staff and our kids got to experience that today. And, and I'm just so proud of everybody in the program, our fans, uh, our Grandview community, our support staff, everybody that's involved at Grandview, this is for them.